Let's see if I can get a quick little read. Sagittarius, Pisces. So somebody could have Sagittarius, Pisces in their chart. <clears throat> they already did those. What? So Scorpio just got that, okay? Yeah, I could be dealing with Scorpio, but somebody... Um, be mindful of cheating and creeping. I'm going to tell everybody that, you know, I said that. Be mindful because it's a situation that could come up where somebody could get caught busted either cheating or creeping or doing something that they're not supposed to. A Libra could be involved in here. Already did. Libra could be a doctor, nurse, somebody that works in the, uh, the medical field, but then I got no. So somebody could be accusing a Libra of something, but of something, but it's not a Libra. Okay. And what's going on? Um, show me what sign this is. Yeah, this is going to be very quick because I've got to walk on. Create the life that you want, whoever this is. And you're going to be doing that with self-love. It could be a cancer in here, but I already did cancer. Travel is advised. Pack your bags. Some of you guys will be traveling. Okay. Yeah, you're going to go through some type of transformation. Because somebody is clearly manipulating somebody. Yeah, there's some type of manipulation going on. I feel like there's a lot of people manipulation and you just don't know it. They're trying to bring a lot of confusion so that you can be, you know. Oh, snap. Hold on. Ooh. Ooh. Big time messed up. Yeah, your ancestors said somebody wants a rebirth with you. This king of pentacles because they know they messed up. Big time. Big, big time. What's going on? Yeah, somebody purposely helped you waste money, time, and resources. Capricorn. Yeah, somebody could be relocating. Tell them how you feel. Somebody was being selfish. It was a lot of BS going on. Somebody will be getting some signs and some messages coming through. Pay attention. Our synchronicity, something going on. Nature is going to give you some signs. Somebody's been trying to manifest somebody's money. Okay. Capricorn. Put this up as I do this. <laughs> Everything is going to be all right. The universe is making a way for you right now. So everything is going to be all right. The universe is making a way for you, Capricorns. <laughs> but there for sure was some manipulation in this mix, for sure. What's going on, my Capricorns? Every journey begins with a small, simple step. I said simple. There's no simple in here. But anyway, every journey begins with the first small step. So there was some type of opportunity or some type of business or journey somebody was supposed to be going on, right? And it was some people around that purposely manipulated the situation. And that's the truth. To keep this person stuck and stuck. You possibly know about it. You may be that person. So you guys strongly are that person. There was some type of new opportunity or beginning or journey that was supposed to happen. Right? And it started with something very small. And these people tried their hardest. Ain't no try. They manipulated you to stop. Because they seen you were stepping in the energy of creating the life that you want. And you had to leave them behind. They didn't like that. You were stepping in your power and you were creating your own life. I'm hearing for some of you guys, you're free. Like the work you do for work, you're you're free. You might have, okay. You might have like an open schedule. You're like free to run. Somebody don't like that. Okay. And it could be your wife with the empress being in reverse or your mother it could be like a mother that's jealous of the fact that the type of job you have they're not used to that they're used to somebody having like a regular nine to five or something but look if it works for you it works for you i know people look when i was doing i, I got all type of crazy not a job it's crazy and you even making money off of doing that what are you doing why are you doing it i'm like just mind your business Look, who is this queen of wands? Who is this woman? It's jealous of your success. Jealous of your clout. I'm trying to tell you, somebody does not want somebody to be successful. And because of that, they're doing some things behind your back. To manipulate a situation, blackmail somebody. They're doing a lot. Slander. 
This could even be somebody's own self-conscious that's holding them back. Somebody has a lot of potential with the Queen of Wands. Very much attractive. You got the job. Okay, you are a leader. You can do it. But it's like your own thoughts are eating up at you. That's making you be scared. Making you be like, well, how are these people going to view me? How are they going to look at me? You worry too much what everybody else has to say. But also, there's somebody that's that's in your, in everybody's business. What is this Queen of Wands? I don't need to go. Three of Pentacles, three. Look, she is like, who are these people that you are working and collaborating with? Somebody don't like the people that you work and collaborate with. Whatever you do is a business, and it, it, and it involves teamwork. You can even be a manager of, okay, this can be somebody that, I don't even know. It's so many different possibilities. Somebody does not like the fact that you work with other people. You might even travel. Um... I don't know, but somebody wants you to cut out everybody that you work with. And it's like, this is a team, right? This is my partnership. This is my people I collaborate with. They, somebody's like, no. I don't like none of them. I don't like none of them. If it's a man, you know what I'm saying? If, you, if you're a woman, they don't like your boss. They don't like your your cubicle buddy, partner. You know what I'm saying? However it goes, they don't, they're jealous. They're insecure. I don't know what it is. I don't, I don't know if it's jealousy. It could be their own conscious. I don't know what it is. But somebody... They're scared of your potential. It is it's insecurity. They're scared of your potential. Eight of Pentacles. This is dealing with work. This is for sure dealing with work. Yeah, and it's causing them. Look, whatever this is, these insecurities, it's breaking up a happy situation. Like the love isn't in it no more because somebody is so focused on what they think is going on when you're not in their presence. Let's be for real, for real, right now. Okay, let me get some cards from my book so I can get in here. Like, you may have a lot of people that come in and out from where you're at, you know, that may travel from around the world. So they might be, like, from the all different walks of life, or the, you know, life, or maybe people that have more money than them, or I don't know what it is, have more opportunities. I don't know, but somebody's for sure insecure. Well, we got an obsessive stalker. I feel like you can't go nowhere without them. So especially if you work and you travel, uh-uh. But you, like, it's yours. I'm yours. But the thing is, this this lover is actually in competition with you. But look, you just got this divine. Wow. Master, they want you to be their sack. You know what? Okay. For some of you guys, this is an exit of yours. That was like that. So there's a divine masculine. Oh, shoot. I'm not about to go that far. I'm about to go now. Some of y'all, they know that there's somebody at th your job that's about to take their place. Oh, I'm the, I'm just the messenger. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, because they've been bringing blocking, look, juggling, blocking, somebody juggling, clarity. I don't know what's going on. Reunion. Okay. Abuse of power. Mm, open your eyes. Now it's time for me to go. Stand your ground. <laughs> Family. And then what finances? Cancer. Okay, moving on. I love y'all so much. Take care.